This is going to be part four of the series of tutorials for building our drive application. We're still building the vehicle. In part three, we just finished adding one wheel, which used to be a uh, prefab, but we unpacked it, deleted the camera and left only the mesh, fixed a bunch of parameters for the wheel itself, which we renamed wheel uh, front right uh we gave it these parameters listed in the in step let's find it out in step 18 then we unpacked it deleted the camera and gave the wheel itself which we renamed mesh it used to be called cylinder uh there's a cylinder rename it mesh we reset its own transform to be all zeros and ones. Now the wheel should be in place. So again, the wheel container with these parameters and the mesh with all zeros and ones. Uh, then we gave this mesh a material. We created a materials folder, wheel mat, and we gave it these parameters uh, with a little bit of emission with like a glow on it, which is also listed in step uh, let's see, uh, number 25, which means right now we're up to step number 26, if I'm not mistaken. So if the wheel looks good, and it looks good to me, duplicate it three more times, the wheel FR, not the mesh. Uh, so we have four containers with four meshes in it, and we're going to rename them uh, BR for uh, back right front left and back left so here it is wheel right click duplicate right click duplicate and right click duplicate now we have four of them let's give them the right names first front right uh, back then the front left and the back left. Let's make sure. Yeah. BR, FL, BL. The hierarchy should look like this, and that's exactly what we got. FR, BR, FL, BL. FR, BR, FL, BL. Now it's time to give those wheels their own um, parameters. Give the other three wheels, not the child mesh, but the wheel containers, uh, the following parameters. And I'm just going to go one at a time. You'll see that it's actually very few changes, mostly from minus to plus. For instance, uh, if the front um, right wheel was here, then the back right wheel, right now sitting exactly the same parameters, is going to be the same thing, only, only with a negative, and you see how it becomes the back right wheel. Save. The front left, They all have pretty much the same numbers, only with like minuses and pluses changing. The front left is instead of plus 55 meters on the right side, negative 55 meters, so it's on the left side, and everything else seems to be the same as the other front wheel. So all I got to do is change this to a negative on the front left, and when I look at it from the top, Move it around a little bit. Yep, here it is. Let me look at it anamorphic. Uh, yep, we already have a front left wheel, which means the back left wheel will be the same, only it will have a negative on the X here. So it moves to the left and also a negative on the Z, so it moves to the back. Put a negative here, and now I got all my four wheels. And when I Option or Alt drag this around, I can see that my we my um, vehicle looks pretty complete. Let's look at the requirements. Now you should see all four wheels, and we do. And you see how this matches the screenshot, and this is good. 
now we got the visuality, the shape of our um, vehicle. And this is the end of stage one. And to submit, what I'd like you to do is simply take a screenshot of your entire Unity um, screen. Let's make sure we can read it. Uh, showing the complete vehicle in the same and or um, in the scene and or the game view. Uh, I prefer seeing both. And the scene hierarchy view, name the screenshot with your last name, underscore drive, underscore stage one. Depending on whether you're using Mac or Windows, the screenshot will be a PNG or a JPEG. And this is what you're submitting. Should look something like this. So if I'm showing my screen, it should show something like this. What I'd really like to see there is the scene, if possible, also the game at the same time. So make a uh, work area where you can see both the scene and the game. If you can't do both, then at least the scene so I can see that the vehicle is complete. And I also want to see the hierarchy. I want to see that there's a plane, a player, um, the OVR camera rig inside the player, then the vehicle, and in the vehicle, a capsule, a U-pipe, front axle, rear axle, and all the uh, the container for all the wheels with wheels, wheel, wheel, wheel. Each wheel has a mesh. So I would even appreciate it if you opened up the hierarchy completely so I can see all of this. Make a screenshot of that and that's all you got to uh, submit. I will see you in part five, which will already start stage two.